King Charles appears to be far less formal than the late Queen Elizabeth, and that shows H is breaking away from her, a royal historian has claimed. The monarch and Queen Camilla are currently on a royal tour of Kenya from October 31st until November 3rd, which is their first visit to a Commonwealth country since their accession last year. Royal historian Marlene Koenig noted that the monarch is doing his job perfectly and knows how to work a crowd as he has been preparing for this role for decades. She told Express.co.uk, If you look at the type of engagements that the king and queen are carrying out, in Kenya, you will see more informal engagements. Charles ordered Indian food from the local food truck. Meeting students are benefiting from the Prince's International Trust. Click here to join our WhatsApp community to be the first to receive news about the royal family he knows how to work a crowd, and he has been preparing for this job as king for decades. The royal historian added, Charles is far less formal than his mother. I do not think the late queen would have stopped at that food truck. Prince Philip might have, however, commenting on the king's speech during which he spoke about Britain's abhorrent and unjustifiable acts of violence committed against Kenyans but failed to apologize, Koenig noted that there's only so much Charles can say or do as monarch. She explained, his speech at the state banquet would have been vetted and advised by the government, on what he could and could not say. Experience the express like never before, advert free experience without interruptions. Rocket fast speedy loading pages. Exclusive unlimited access to all our content. Start 30 day free trial. He must avoid controversy, and it would be the government to provide an apology. The implications of the king speaking on his own would or could contribute to a constitutional crisis. When he was Prince of Wales, he spoke out about the injustices of British colonialism but now he must be careful about the words he uses. Meanwhile, the royal historian praised Queen Camilla who, unlike the late Queen, is undertaking engagements that might make some people squirm. She said, Queen Camilla is undertaking engagements that are aligned with her own interests. She has been a long-time advocate for sexual abuse victims, and has continued this in Kenya by meeting with sexual abuse victims. For the, late, queen, it would have been tea with a group of ladies. But that was the past. Queen Camilla is not afraid to take on engagements that might make some people squirm. Supporting and meeting with sexual abuse victims is a powerful statement.